Hello everyone. For my um, International ASMR Day video, I thought I would talk about how I discovered the ASMR community and also talk about some of my favorite whisperers and their videos. So to start out with, um, the first thing we have to talk about is Reddit. Um, I've been part of Reddit for many years and I was bored one day and decided to do a search for some random subreddits and one of them came up and it was ASMR and as soon as I read the description I knew exactly what it was talking about and even though I hadn't really experienced ASMR in a while mostly when I was in high school and college um, it was neat to find a community of people who had experienced the same thing um, because I never really knew anybody else did and that seems to be a, a really common theme of people who have a ASMR is they don't realize that other people experience it as well so I went through um, a lot of the videos that were on that page and the first one that really stuck out in my mind was visual sounds and with her video um, the nail polishing one I really discovered and experienced my first ASMR in a long time and um, it was absolutely wonderful and so I watched several other of her videos and I started to explore other whispers um, through the videos that were on Reddit as well as the videos that were linked to um, their channels in YouTube and the next one I discovered was Whisper Crystal and once again I discovered a fantastic whisperer who um, whose voice um, and the quality of it and the the sound of it was just amazingly relaxing and gave me lots of um, tingles and so from then on I was kind of hooked and I went from listening to visual sounds to whisper crystal and a few others but those two were the ones that stood out the most and then the next one I discovered was Whisperish and her video of um, her soft spoken hair play where she brushes her hair um, was another amazing one that I experienced tingles with so then I had three main um, ASMR video creators that I watched and I did that for several days and then I discovered Gentle Whisperings and her first video that gave me tingles was her relaxing makeup role play and it was about this time as I'm going through all these different videos that I'm thinking about um, the idea that this is something that I could do as well and I really started to get excited about that and so I um, I asked on reddit if um, there were very many male ASMR creators and because I noticed that um, there was a lots of female ones and the answer I got back was that there were a few male um, whispers but not a whole lot and so I saw that there was definitely a need for a male whisperer. So um, I started my channel. And it was about this time that I discovered another whisperer. And that whisperer was Lilium Candidium, if that's how you pronounce her name. Can Candidum? 
however you pronounce it. She was amazing. And I added her to my list of all-time favorite whisperers. And um, many of her sound videos were incredible. Um, and unfortunately, she no longer makes them. So I built this little shrine. And I put this, um, this torch here to burn in remembrance of her. And hopefully, we will hear her voice again. So, then going on from there, several months, well, I guess weeks, I'm listening to all these videos and I discovered Aurora Whispers. And specifically her um, whisper number 100, her full body massage whisper. Um, amazing video. And so she was added to my list as I listened to more and more of her videos. I consistently would get tingles from that. And then the next one that made my list was Tracy's Hot 101. And I specifically liked her school secretary video. I think that's the first one that I um, listened to of hers. And the quality of her voice was just amazing with her whispering. And a lot of her other videos that I watched, I really enjoyed as well. And so I followed her and subscribed to her, and she joined the list. And by this time, I'm well into making videos and still discovering new whispers all the time. And they start to really grow and multiply and the whisper community really starts to come together and more and more whispers are creating videos every day and so I discovered Nat at 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 um, if that's how you pronounce that correctly and I loved her rambling style of videos um, specifically like her ASMR sketchbook video. And then I added to the list Kath 1000. And her videos like her ASMR candle lighting video um, are amazing. And at this point in time I'm starting to add a lot of people to my list so these are just kind of the ones that stood out in my mind the most um i've probably got a list by this time of 25 whispers that i follow and it usually grows at least i add one or two every day so there's just so many out there um but the next one that really gave me amazing tingles was little miss whispers and her number 17 tapping relaxation. Um, this is some of the strongest tingles I felt um, from this one. And it's very odd because I normally don't get them from tapping videos. But um, in this one, she's just tapping on a, um, a lamp. And it's the ringing quality of the ceramic or whatever it is. And then her softly whispering and she really pronounces her S's in a specific way. Um, it was just like the perfect combination of things that normally don't cause me a trigger. Um, they just all came together perfectly. It was an amazing video. And then I discovered um, a unique video maker called Tarmanezzi. And he would take videos of whisperers and combine them with trance music or house music or um, other types of audio 
and he would layer the whispers on top of each other and create a soundscape that is very different than just a straight whisper video. Um, and I thoroughly enjoy every single one of the videos that he makes. And I've put this little shrine here for him as well because he no longer makes them, but he, all of his videos so far are still up and available on his channel. So I would definitely recommend that you go and check out his work. Um, it is really unique and really beautiful. So the next on my list was another unique video maker who's been doing it for a very, very long time. Um, not necessarily even an intentional ASMR video creator, but one that constantly ranks up there among my favorite. And that's RR Cherry Pie. Um, these videos are unwrapping videos, but they're also process videos of Japanese products, usually candy and miniature um, replicas of food. And each one of them is unique and very different. There's no talking. So it's all unwrapping and watching the process of making these elaborate candies from these packages that you can buy in Japan. Um, very good quality and very relaxing and I just enjoy every single one of them. So the next one is Pig's Bum 53 and specifically her videos such as her favorite books. And now we're starting to get into some of the more recent um, whispers that I've enjoyed in the last few months and weeks. And um, kind of bringing this up current with what is going on today in the Whisper community. And um, so Pig's Bomb 53, um, each one of her videos gets better and better. I'm really enjoying watching what she's doing. And then we have Appreciate ASMR, who um, has come on in recent weeks and has done an absolutely phenomenal job of making great ASMR videos. And I want to thank her for encouraging me to get on Facebook and to um, connect with the ASMR community a little bit more than I had been doing. Um, and so I really appreciate that. And let's see. The next would be Amal's, Amal's D. Um, another new whisperer um, in the last few weeks who also does amazing work. Um, another kind of ramble style video. I really enjoyed her um, one that she does about um, coloring and rambling while she's coloring. And also her um, ramble she does while smoking the hookah. Um, I thoroughly enjoyed that one as well. And then this is just a reminder that as our community grows, we attract positive attention and negative attention. And so this is a reminder to not feed the trolls. They um, love attention. And so the best thing you can do is block them or ignore them. So. We're going to block them. Literally. <laughs> so now moving on. We come to another new whisperer, the Water Whispers. Um, another of one of the more recent, very high quality whisperers. Um, her videos, like her rambling about the fish in her tank and taking us through her apartment 
and many others like that. Um, pretty much anyone that she does is amazing. Um, gives me tingles all the time. And then the last one that I'll mention here on this list is Sweet Seductive ASMR. Um, the quality of her voice is astounding. Um, her makeup role play and her accent and pretty much every video she does as well um, gives me a tingle of some sort. And um, so she's the last one here on this list, but by no means um, are these all the whispers that I um, enjoy? These are just the ones that kind of consistently give me um, the trigger my ASMR. And starting down with the um, the first ones I discovered, um, probably the reason that I got so involved in this community is the first ones that I came across were so excellent and of such high quality. So, um, this list is not in a best to worst. It is more just of a timeline of how I got um, involved in the community in the whispers that I discovered. So, I want to thank you all for the videos that you make and the support of this community. And I love um, seeing it grow. And the last thing I want to do is I want to wish you all a happy ASMR day. And I am very glad to be part of this community. And I'm very glad that you guys like my videos. And I will continue making them. So enjoy all the other videos that are being made for this day. And I look forward to watching every single one of them. Okay? Thank you all. Bye.